Hello Gemini! Thank you very much for tuning in to this week's read. For the main part of the read, I'm using Art of Love Tarot by Denise Jarvie. Artwork by Tony Carmine Salerno. Website on the back here is blueangelonline.com. Feel free to check that out if you're interested. Supportive Oracle Cards. You are Clairvoyant Oracle Cards by Belinda Grace. Illustrations by Elaine Marzen. Website on the back, rockpoolpublishing.com.au. A is an apple, U is an umbrella. All right. Gemini. A lot of energy coming in with that. Okay. Let's put these out first. So the energy is currently good. I don't know what... I think you... I don't think this is going to be bad, but... I'm not saying that the whole trip's going to be enjoyable, but I don't think this is going to be bad. Um, I think you're going to turn a rough moment into something positive is where this is supposed to go. Okay, so you seem to know where you want to go. I do feel like whatever this is, I feel like it's better to say it's been on the back burner for a while. It's not like you, I wouldn't say you've been waiting. I don't think that's the right way to put it. I feel like you've had ideas and you've thought things out, but when you were thinking it out, it just wasn't time for it. So it's kind of like I put it to the back burner. It's not like I've been waiting. It's more like I just like, okay, I can't do that right now, so I'm going to put it over here. And I went and did other things. Because um, I get this Seven of Pentacles. You've been thinking about something. When you first came across it, you just didn't have it. Maybe you didn't have enough funds, or you weren't in the right position, or whatever it was. Whenever it started, whenever the situation started, you knew what you wanted, but you didn't have what it took to make it move forward. It could have been a money issue whatever it was just maybe the right people weren't in your life yet it just wasn't there yet but you knew what you wanted so you put it on the back burner you kind of went on and did other things so that moment seems like it's coming forward the thing is i feel like it's going to go into another delay because i feel like it was on the back burner it comes forward again I think it's about to hit another delay, though. Okay. Where are we going with this? Where are we going with this? Seven of swords, half in, half out. And the 15, which is the devil card, half in, half out. I think of Gemini as somebody who kind of just... You, you just do roll with the punches. It's not like, I, I don't know, it's not like you're trying to roll with them. It's just things go a little bit fluky and you just kind of do what you have to do and you keep going. Um, you find a, another way to handle things. And I, I feel like, when I don't want to say you're rolling with the punches because it's not like you want to. It's just kind of like, well, that happened, so this is what I need to do. Uh, I'll do this and then I'll do that. And you just handle it the way you need to handle it. Because it was on the back burner, it was coming forward again, you're like, oh, I think I can have this, and then another delay. Um, this situation is not over. It may feel like it, and I feel like that's the problem. Because when the wheel turns again at this point, I feel like maybe I'm never going to get what I want. I know what I wanted. I couldn't have it before for whatever reason, so I just kind of put it at the back burner. Came forward, thought I was going to have it this time, then poof, there it goes again. The Wheel of Fortune turned on you. But this is not the end of the story. Um, the thing is here is to not let it hold you down, which could be quite an undertaking. Because whatever this is, it feels like it means a lot to you. Um, and... 
while Gemini can easily see a lot of different ways things could happen, it's not so much as seeing how it could happen, it's actually having it happen is the difference here. Uh, you can see a lot of different avenues. It's making them happen that I feel like is bothering you. It's kind of like, yeah, I can see how this could happen, but I need it to happen, and it hasn't. In this moment, if you realize that it's not over, but it just kind of feels like it, I feel like you can be fine. This is saying there's there's good energy coming in here. Kuan Yin kind of gives me this, like, it kind of gives me, like, this Gaia feel, um, care for the world, things moving forward. Even though you may not see it, it's still going forward. Chakra balancing, you also got these Four of Swords, which is a healing card. Things are going to keep coming forward. It's just like right now it's not working out the way you want. I feel like I'm bothered though because I'm like, I don't feel like it's ever going to come forward and I'm very upset about it. And I'm like, I guess maybe this just isn't in my life this time around. I don't feel like that's the case. And it, it's kind of like, don't let it hold you down. Let it go to the back burner again. Which seems like, I feel like that's a lot to ask. To let it go to the back burner again. Um, if you let it go to the back burner again and don't count it as out, and the, like whatever it is, like maybe you had some things saved up, maybe you had some notes, maybe you had some items you were holding to the side, maybe you were saving money for this situation. Continue saving, continue holding the stuff to the side, don't get rid of it. So for example, if you were like saving for your dream house, you thought it was going to happen, then it fell through and you didn't get it. Keep saving for your dream house, don't stop. Don't stop. The, the, the story is not over is what I keep getting from this. Um, we got more coming forward. It may not happen this year, whatever it is you're looking for, but what they're saying is like, as quick as it disappears is as quick as it reappears. Favor will come back to you at some point. This will go your way. The, the tower will bring it back. Will they say the ego will collapse? I'm, this is normally the tower card, the 16. It's gonna, you're not going to see it coming, ironically. All of a sudden, the opportunity will reappear for you. You won't see it. And the, thing, and the power will be back in your hands. Prosperity is backing this up. It will return. It's just kind of like, I feel like I'm exhausted. And I'm just like, yeah, but I, I've been waiting for so long. It's never happened like that before. But you know how random life can be. I feel like Gemini knows that better than most signs. How random life can be. Life can be very random and just opportunity pops out of nowhere sometimes. The opportunity will come back. Prosperity. Like, I don't want to lose the prosperity here. Um, it will come back. It will be for you. You will have what you're looking for. Let it go to the back burner. Don't give up. That's the that's like the advice. Don't give up. Because I'm getting like, there's a foundation here. And I feel like the universe is trying to help you make this happen. It's just kind of like... So, for example, it's kind of like maybe there's a certain house you want. It's a dream house. I thought it was going to happen. Then whatever reason, phew, it doesn't happen. I don't get it. And the universe might be saying, yeah, but you don't realize what was going on in that house. You don't realize the damage that needed to be fixed at first. Um, there's something with this, like, or maybe they're saying you may have thought that was the perfect house for you. But the where your life is going and where you need to be, there's also a great house for you closer to where you need to be for your life to work out in a positive way. There's something here where they're saying it may have looked like this was the one for you, but it's not. The universe is saying it has something better for you, but it's still, the universe is rooting for you. It's like, there's, it's not over. They're just going to kind of reform this in a better fashion. It may turn out better than you expected. You may not even realize what you need in the future because you haven't gotten there yet. They're just asking that you don't write it off. Don't write it off. Let it go to the back burner again. Keep dreaming. It says automatic writing, but I'm feeling like keep dreaming. Keep going for your goals. Keep looking for it. Don't give up on it. Let it go to the back burner again. It's hard to wait, but it's like don't give up. I feel like that's what they're saying. Just don't give up. It's still out there. It's going to snap back in as quick as it left. Like this, like this situation, whatever you were waiting for, and you thought this is the time, and it's gone in five seconds, it comes right back the same way. Like Just like that. 
So if you have everything prepared, you just keep waiting, you have everything there, it'll show up, it'll show up without you realizing it. It's just gonna poof, it'll be there. Not this year probably, but you know, in the future it'll show right up. So don't give up. Anything else? All right, I'm going to shut this down here. I hope that helps. Thank you for watching. If you'd like a direct reading from me, shoot me an email, jamesforastral at gmail.com. That's james, the number four, astral at gmail.com. If you're interested in the donation information, that's below. Same email. Thank you very much for watching, and have a great day.